Hey y'all, what's going on? You all have tapped in with Black Goddess Intuitive Healer, and I'm here to bring you all messages for Divine Feminine. What's up, Divine Feminine? How y'all doing? I know that y'all are doing well, okay? Because it's all about the intentions you set. It's all about what you're putting out into the universe. And I'm hearing that you guys are doing amazing, Divine Feminine, okay? Y'all had some obstacles that y'all initially had to persevere through. I'm hearing that job well done. That's what I'm hearing. Thank you, Spirit. Job well done. And you guys should be very proud of yourselves. I'm hearing that you guys have like got through like different things that y'all didn't think that y'all was going to be able to persevere through. I'm hearing that y'all was so a lot of y'all was ready to give up. I'm glad y'all didn't give up divine feminine cuz nah. We don't give up over here. We some warriors. That's just period. Got this Palo Santo going. I love the smell of this Palo Santo. Y'all know this full moon is uh, in Taurus, okay? So, y'all double up on y'all protection. Y'all double up on y'all grounding and different rituals that you all do for yourselves. Set positive intentions. All right, y'all have already done that. Y'all have already planted several seeds that are about to just blow up here. So... Y'all just, y'all was walking with faith. Y'all have faith in the people that support y'all, which is y'all spirit team on a stronger level here. I feel like the guidance, y'all spiritual guidance and y'all benevolent ancestors, baby, when I say that they have done the work that they supposed to do, okay, and they drag y'all. <laughs> literally drag y'all divine feminine like oh oh you gonna do what you supposed to do like yeah so for divine feminine spirit I am using a new deck that I purchased the other day it is called the Lover's Path Tarot. My bad, y'all. Let's get us a good shuffle. This is my first time using it, so it's like an unboxed video for Divine Feminine with this new deck here. Y'all know I got a lot of decks here. Um, I try initially to get y'all to show y'all what's going on in y'all current situation and or I try not to do too much past stuff and I'll be because we moving forward we ain't stuck in the past so you know what I'm saying so I try to aim towards the present moment and what's to come you know what I'm saying not necessarily the future but what's to come okay for Divine Feminine. I hope you all are having a wonderful day, Divine Feminine. Okay, for some reason, they don't want me to use those. I don't know why I shuffled them a hundred times. They want me to use Black Goddess Oracle. So we're going to use the Oracle. Okay, we'll use the Oracle spirit. Archangel Michael, come in and protect our energy in our work field at this time. Benevolent ancestors, I know y'all are here. Show us what we need to see. Current messages for the Divine Feminine. The beautiful Divine Feminine, okay? For Divine Feminine. Some of y'all could have recently been irritated, okay? I feel like I feel like a lot of y'all be getting irritated by um, folks that know they shouldn't even be trying to contact you or 
trying to be around y'all and stuff like that and and trying to be in y'all energy like y'all already know different things y'all need to know about these people that's trying to come back around and it's like it's an ignoring it's it, it's excuse me it's annoying and y'all have been ignoring <laughs> my bad it says now why you keep ignoring me yeah so the more you're the divine feminine the more you're ignoring people the more irritated they're getting because people have to initially move on with their life and that's what people are failing to realize here in the situation it says stop holding that grudge it's not helping you so divine feminine this is only for a few of you okay very significant message spirit is saying for you to let that uh grudge go this could be some type of resentment that you could be still dealing with and or somebody could be also gossiping here divine feminine about the changes that you've made here okay somebody could definitely be gossiping all right i feel like this energy that wants to come back around is is what initially had y'all irritated i'm definitely getting that somebody definitely running their mouth here okay for Divine Feminine, current energy. Y'all good on y'all own, Divine Feminine. I'm definitely getting that. A lot of you all have new contracts coming in here. So y'all are enjoying being single um, until y'all initial Divine Connection comes in. I'm definitely getting that. Thank you, Spirit. Please leave me alone. I am not your girl anymore. You need to watch your tone. know that it is not you <laughs> all right divine feminine none of my concern anymore all right so y'all not concerned about this past person this past person is missing y'all's friendship here okay i feel like this person don't even got that right now this person knows that they made a big mistake here divine feminine all right Y'all have been paying attention to the signs around y'all. Show me what I need to thank you. All right, Divine Feminine. Somebody definitely wants to come in and talk. I'm seeing swift communication. I'm hearing like fast communication. Somebody wants to come in fast here. It says, I still love you, but you're guarded. So yeah, a lot of y'all are guarded towards this past person here. Just leave it outside. Give me a second. They knew not to knock on my door. I'm coming to my feminine. I had to get my lunch. My bad, y'all. Okay, my bad, my bad. They normally just leave my food out there for me to get it, but I guess today they wanted to knock, and then she also still walked away. Like, really? But anyway, back to this energy. My thick ass running up and down them damn stairs. All right. Yeah, y'all have been guarded towards this energy because of just, and I'm also feeling like the irritation was also coming from, like, sometimes when y'all go back to thinking about certain shit, y'all get annoyed a little bit, not necessarily triggered because a lot of you all have been doing y'all shadow work. Let me catch my damn breath, okay? DoorDash was a distraction. This person wants to come in to distract y'all from off y'all journey, okay? That's what I got from the whole DoorDash order, me getting distracted from y'all video, because normally they just leave it out there, but not today. They wanted to knock, so this person could be coming to your house. It says, I'm coming to your house tonight. Open the door. It doesn't necessarily have to be tonight, but it's going to be soon here. This person definitely wants to talk divine feminine. It says, ready to talk. I really miss you. So, yeah, somebody misses you here. <clears throat> this person's wanting some type of start over here, okay? I'm hearing that this person is a repeat offender, okay? Um, I'm hearing y'all have done a lot of work. Like, y'all have, like, overdid yourselves here. Like, I feel like y'all so far gone into y'all healing here that y'all wouldn't even consider 
a second chance for this energy here because y'all a lot of some majority of y'all are in the energy of forgiving and just new beginnings and just being ready to just do something new and y'all in this new energy divine feminine which is beautiful it ain't perfect but everything is beautiful here for sure thank you Janae Aiko y'all living y'all life this says, live your life. It's time. Y'all are living y'all life here. Y'all ready for it, too. Y'all ready for this new beginnings. Y'all got exclusive relationships. Y'all got a power couple here. I mean, excuse me. <laughs> y'all are going to be a power couple with this new connection here. Whoever this individual is to y'all. Well, excuse me. He could current this current this part. Damn, I can't even talk right. This person could currently be in y'all energy at this time. Remember, y'all don't necessarily got to meet y'all divine soulmates in order in, for, in, for them to be in y'all's energy, okay? Because we already, we start off with te telepathy, okay, with these soulmates. All right. I feel like this past person does feel like you're dating here, divine feminine, which is true for some of y'all, okay? This person be, could be getting um, healing sessions and or readings on you, divine feminine, to... Just keep tabs on you, DF. Like, of course, everybody keeping tabs on Divine Feminine. Like, why? Like, come on now. Y'all took a leap of faith. Y'all took a leap of faith here into y'all new beginnings. Y'all couldn't look back no more. It was like y'all sat in... Y'all sat in that hurt, in that heartbreak of y'all not have, being apes for some of y'all for y'all not to be able to have y'all twin when y'all was yearning for this person okay so y'all had to take a leap of faith here because things weren't changing divine feminine y'all already know who y'all star players is y'all know who was changing and who was not and i feel like y'all know who checking up on y'all too um so, yes, this person has been yearning for y'all, Divine Feminine. Yes, this is your twin flame. This person is doing some type of healing here. Somebody's doing some healing here. For some of y'all, this person is doing the work. Um, This person doesn't feel like it's too late. This person still feels... some. For some of y'all, this person feels like there's a chance here, Divine Feminine. This is what Spirit wants y'all to see today, DF, okay? Somebody could be burning candles on y'all, Divine Feminine. But I feel like this is more of a... Yeah, I know I did wrong. I know I manipulated some shit here. But I'm still trying to manifest you back into my life. Have me under. This is my song. It says, planning to cause problems in your life. Somebody trying to come back around. For some of y'all, somebody is trying to come back around and cause problems here. I'm hearing because you rejected them. And yeah, they're like, ever since you rejected this person, their life has been a mess. Their life has fallen apart. My cards just fell apart. <laughs> Somebody could be definitely into the dark arts here, Divine Feminine. I feel like y'all already know that. Sorry, excuse me, y'all. I am so sorry. But I feel like y'all already know that. This person sold their soul here with the Don't Sell Your Soul card. This person sold their soul. I feel like this person could be a part of something here and they could be working with somebody else in the background here to cause problems here current energy spirit who's who's planning this old the twins somebody that's not healing that came out in the reverse somebody still wants to cause problems in your life df because they not doing the work for themselves they wanted to take the the darker way out. They wanted to take the easier route out here. And now they sitting here yearning for you. But they not healing. They not doing the work. This person could have did the unthinkable. And that's why a lot of y'all have just like, uh-uh, I don't even. Yep, somebody's getting card, um, getting, excuse me. Somebody is pulling cards on you to keep tabs on you. Like I said, somebody's been tapping in a divination them damn selves. It says, I have nothing without you. So this person feels like they have nothing without you. Like I said, as soon as y'all 
took your energy from this person, they life fell apart, okay? I'm hearing for some of y'all was like, every time you hurt me, you hurt yourself. I hope you know that. And I feel like y'all told this person that years ago, okay? This was y'all twin flame. And I feel like every time this person does hurt you, they hurt themselves, okay? Um, y'all share the same soul. You know what I'm saying? And, and, and it says, I can't get you out of my mind. You stay in my energy. So this is y'all twin flame here. Y'all know y'all got free will. Some of y'all twin flame karmic and toxic as hell. Y'all know that already. They're demon them, them karmics. They sending them in the test y'all, of course. But then some of y'all twin flames is like, look, baby, I love you. I want to do this. Let's make it work. I'm not that. I wasn't that bad. All y'all twins ain't toxic. Some of y'all twins is like, uh-uh, I'm ready for my DF. That's just period. It says you battled your toughest demon, a lifetime curse. So y'all broke y'all broke a, a lifetime curse. Y'all could have had several lifetimes with this individual where shit just was never working out, DF. Y'all, you know, I feel like this person could have caused a lot of problems here in those past lives as well to where y'all having to pay to close out karmic cycles and shit in a new lifetime. And what the hell was your, what, what, what was you doing in the, the past lives <laughs> to where we having to pay all this damn karma? Well, we having to close out tough ass karmic cycles. Okay. I feel like this person could have broken y'all at some point, DF. You know what I'm saying? They broke you down here. I'm definitely getting that. But y'all are so, 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 so strong right now. And y'all are loving y'all selves. Y'all are loving y'all bodies. Like y'all are em truly embracing y'all bodies. And that's beautiful. Like, y'all are in amazing energy right now. I feel like y'all got back up and y'all got back to what it is that y'all was supposed to do. During, you know, during the midst of the betrayal and or the heartbreak. Y'all persevered through that shit, and it didn't do nothing but make y'all stronger, Divine Feminine. And that's beautiful. It didn't do nothing but make y'all stronger, make y'all more powerful, and make y'all be able to persevere through anything else that comes y'all way. I'm hearing y'all are even looking at death differently, okay? Um, not that y'all are being insensitive or something like that, but... Like, just being able to persevere, perseverance through, like, grief and or pain. And y'all looking more at death as more like a celebration of life, okay? For certain individuals, like, for certain situations, though, Divine Feminine, I'm, again, I'm not trying to be insensitive, but y'all not staying in that energy. Y'all y'all have that day or a few days of grief, and then y'all be, you know what I'm saying? Y'all be having to get back to it. It says, I love you. This is torturing me. Let's meet up. So, yes, it's a past person here that wants to meet up with y'all, Divine Feminine, okay? So, take the energy as it resonates for your situation. So, your twin flame definitely wants to meet up here. For some of y'all, like I said, this person is healing and getting themselves in order. This person wants y'all to wait. Y'all twin wants y'all to wait for y'all. For some of y'all, for the ones that got a twin flame. Y'all divine masculine, the one that y'all know that is going to be a good man for you. The one that y'all already have had dreams about. The one that y'all might have had some type of history and you loved him and something happened and then he want to come back or whatever. Y'all get on y'all journey. This is for y'all. Okay. This person wants y'all to wait for this, for wait for him or her. Well, this y'all reading. So wait for him. Y'all masculine here wants y'all to wait for him. And then y'all know y'all got a toxic karmic masculine here <clears throat> that is coming to cause problems. So they saying for y'all to pay attention to the signs, pay attention to the signs around you. Okay. Y'all not letting nobody, nothing, nothing bypass y'all. And for some of y'all don't want this person to even come bothering y'all. Y'all twin. Okay. So take the energy as it resonates. Some of y'all got some good twin flames and some of y'all got some duds and it's okay. We get the duds. We get the false twins. We have to learn the lessons. We have to move forward. Then we get the blessings. You know what I'm saying? Perseverance. We set the intentions on positive energy and perseverance. We are moving forward, divine feminine. And we, we ain't finna be entertaining. No distractions here. We don't got time. All right, let's change the deck here. Okay, so let's see Divine Feminine. 
who is trying to come besides the we know the karmic twin is going to come and try to cause some type of delays in your life this person has been repetitively doing black magic and stalking your house to get you back we know that already okay this person some addictions here is affecting this person as well divine feminine um this person is trying to delay a dream we know that <laughs> All right, they could also be looking up to you as well and be trying to look to you for some type of help. I feel like this person could know you got a major opportunity in business here. Okay, um, this person could want to fight. <laughs> I got the love is blind card. So this person could want to fight your new soulmate. They want to fight for you. I feel like for some of y'all, y'all are relocating for work. This person knows that you're relocating for work for business. Okay, this person knows he. Show me what I need to see for Divine Feminine Spirit. Current Energy, Archangel Michael, come through with the come through, period. Okay. So this person, Divine Feminine, this person could have been dealing with your... Um, I did not want to... Okay, red flags. We're not going to we, we not gonna drift off into that at all. Show us the people that are trying to... Ruin divine feminine current energy. Show me what I need to see, spirit. Show us who's still playing behind the veil when we can clearly see. Show us what we need to see for divine feminine current energy for divine feminine. Show us who we need to get clear clarity on that we might have not got clarity on, spirit, which I know we have. We covered pretty much all the star players, but show us who's currently trying to do something. Who's currently doing the black magic? Who's currently projecting false energy? Show us some zodiac signs for divine feminine. Remember to take these messages as they resonate. Nothing but the real thing, the truth. So, yes. Somebody's still working overtime, DF, to destroy you. They have not been successful. I'm hearing glamour spells. You're still beautiful. They mess, trying to mess with your gifts and your intuition. You lit. You connecting people to loved ones, Divine Feminine. Y'all are all the way fully tapped in the source here. Y'all are truly chosen, Divine Feminines, okay? So that's the truth. Yeah, people are still in the background doing stuff, trying to stop your success. We're going to take it. They trying to stop your success. They don't want you to be successful, Divine Feminine. They, and they're obsessing with this shit, too. They're accessing their, excuse me, they don't have, they, they're trying to get, um, well, they're obsessively doing black magic. They're obsessing to try to stop you from becoming successful divine feminine, which is the truth. They wanting to stop your new contract here with your new soulmate. We got us a female air sign. Libra, Gemini, or Aquarius that could be trying to ruin you, Divine Feminine. So you got a Libra, Gemini, and or Aquarius that's still currently doing black magic behind the scenes that's trying to stop your success and that's trying to stop your new contracts here. Jealous much? Okay, so... This person is not changing. Whoever this female air sign is that came, that I came out... This person is not changing. They feel like you're changing. You changed up. You know what I'm saying? This person is could be highly insecure, divine feminine, feeling some type of way because I feel like this, whoever this um female air sign is, um, Libra, Gemini, and or Aquarius has some type of STD here. They bitter as shit about it. And that situation not finna change, okay? I'm definitely getting that um, this STD that this person contracted has a, had a lot to do with their karma here on earth at, at this time because of all the black magic that was being done. Okay, so they not, shit not finna change for them. Shit finna stay the same. So they were doing black magic on your, your success and your new love connections and things that y'all worked hard for, DF. But I'm seeing here that nothing is going to change in a situation as part of their karma. And with somebody got a, a STD, that they, somebody got a sexually transmitted disease here that they cannot erase. We got a male fire sign here, Aries, Leo, and or Sagittarius, Divine Feminine. So that could be 
a person very significant to your situation that was doing black magic. Yeah, somebody was meeting up with somebody here. Plotting. Could have been a baby mama here. Oh, it was. It was a baby mama, Divine Feminine. Somebody baby mama. Somebody meeting up with their baby mama or... Yeah, somebody finna go to jail. Yep, somebody finna go to jail here when they get caught up, Divine Feminine, for whoever that's for. Somebody on the run, Divine Feminine. Show us who we need to see that's still currently doing black magic. Okay, okay Divine Feminine. So your karmic best friend is still doing black magic here. She ain't learned her lesson yet, DF. She ain't learned her lesson yet. And she finna go to jail. So your karmic best friend is still currently doing black magic and trying to stop everything for you. <laughs> trying to stop your gifts. They can't stand that you clairvoyant. This been coming out about these gifts. They trying to stop. They, they trying to do black magic on them gifts. They can't stand that you a clairvoyant, that you got these clairvoyant gifts. Anyway, somebody's in spiritual jail and somebody's on their way to physical jail. Praise the Lord. Blessings. Sending you blessings. Show them mercy. Show them mercy, uh, the Most High. Show them mercy. For DF, Divine Feminine. Show us what... Thank you. They scared of your gifts. So they scared of your gifts. Y'all are highly gifted. Y'all clairvoyant. Y'all got a karmic best friend here. We got a male fire sign here. We got an air sign here. Okay. Show me what I need to see for Divine Feminine. Mediumship. Y'all got mediumship gifts. They was trying to... They wanted them gifts. They want y'all gifts bad as shit. <laughs> yeah, so... These people are about to really deal with some shit here. It says the hard part is over, but it's in the reverse. So they finna go through a hard... A hard time here with that karma. They finna... Somebody is about to deal with a lot of different things that they was... Things that they were projecting on y'all with these spells and stuff that they were doing, they finna go through it, baby, here, Divine Feminine. Or so this shit could be currently happening here because of reckless behavior. Because of reckless behavior. And I feel like people were moving um, the way this person was moving, how they move, Divine Feminine. They want me to talk about this karmic best friend. They would... They, they, okay. Okay. This person here is needing to heal, okay? That's why this person's behavior is so reckless, okay? I'm hearing that this person is definitely um, has a lot of trauma that they need to heal from. This person is needing to speak up about their trauma. So, these are adults we're talking about here. You know somebody affected you. You know somebody did something to you. You know what I'm saying? You got to heal that shit. You can't move around with reckless behavior, and putting a bunch of harsh ass karma on yourself, cross watcher. I feel like this person felt some type of way because you stopped telling them your business. You stopped telling this person your business. You detached yourself from this person fully. Okay, let's shuffle. Current energy for Divine Feminine. Show us what we need to see. Show us what we need to be mindful of in this next few weeks here, Spirit. I'm going to give it a month. Few, the next month. Show us who's currently on the outside that needs to stay on the outside. For Divine Feminine. Thank you. Your karmic twin. <laughs> So, it's y'all know who y'all twin is. And if they in this energy, this karmic energy, they need to stay on the outside. We are preparing for the new year, y'all. Leave these folks behind. Don't argue with them. Don't fight with them. Don't. Because as soon as you get to arguing with them, there you go signing a new cycle. No. I. You know what? 
I'm sending you healing. I'm, I love you and all of that stuff. But there will be no new contracts with us. Okay. I, I, I forgive you. Period. That's where y'all at. Somebody is, damn. Somebody definitely in regret here. Your karmic twin is in regret. This person is currently stalking your house too. Yep. We got, um, yeah, this person in karmic energy. Because it's in reverse. So they in karmic energy. Trust y'all intuition. My nose itching. Trust y'all intuition. This person been stalking the shit out of y'all. This person been stalking the shit out of y'all. Somebody, this karmic masculine here. Okay? A lot of shit was supposed to happen here. A lot of shit was supposed to happen. The universe um, orchestrated a lot of different things, Divine Feminine. Y'all already know that. My nose. Y'all know when my nose itch. Twinkle toes and shit. <laughs> but anyway... Let's do a closing message for Divine Feminine Spirit. Okay, so a lot of this stuff, no, we're going to do y'all closing messages with the healing deck. It's something very significant and, and um, that something's going to happen fall in the fall of next year, Divine Feminine. Or something, yeah, something's going to happen. It says, I went, yeah, this person chose wrong. And who they chose, they thought was a divine being. They thought was a divine feminine. This person was not, is currently not a divine feminine. They made a wrong, they made a terrible decision. Okay. Let's make a decision fast in the reverse. They made a terrible decision. I said, it says, I went looking for you and others. I still ain't found one like you. Absolutely not. This person could be falling in love with you all over again, divine feminine. Take the energy as it resonates. Closing messages. Closing messages for Divine Feminine. Remember to like, share, and subscribe to the channel, y'all, so y'all can vibe with me. All right. Take these messages as they resonate, Divine Feminine, and leave the rest, okay? This person is feeling guilty. It says, I love you. This is torturing me. Let's meet up. So this person does want to meet up. We saw that already. Closing messages for Divine Feminine. This person can't get you off their mind. This is, I can't get you off my mind. You stay in my energy. Closing messages for Divine Feminine. I'm proud of you. You are so amazing to me. So for some of y'all, y'all Twin Flame is proud of y'all. And they want y'all.